Hello, my beautiful Aquarius. Welcome to your August love reading. This will be for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Keep in mind, energy can go vice versa, and this reading won't resonate with everyone. So take what fits and leave the rest out. Okay, we have action with door to romance. Looks like someone's finally doing something about uh, what their heart feels they need to do. Okay, so it's already showing me there could have been some hesitation here or this has been really stuck for a while. Missed opportunity. Yeah, I didn't act when I should have with reciprocity. I want to have equal give and take. Yeah, so this person's acknowledging here that uh, they didn't really give to you what you deserve. Okay, wanting to take it back or change things here. Overall energy, Ten of Pentacles. This is about commitment, stability. Okay, having a firm, solid foundation. Okay, so let's see what's going on uh, with your energy this month. I just heard I wanted commitment but didn't know how to get there. So somebody might have always wanted to commit uh, but went against what they wanted. Okay, Three of Pentacles, the Wheel, and the Hermit. Okay, so again, you know what's showing me, guys? Uh, it always does this for you. You really are selfless beings. You definitely um, help people beyond where there are no limits, okay, to what you can do and achieve for people here, uh, even sacrificing a lot for yourself. But I see this is a, a blessed month for you, okay? Things are finally shifting, especially with the new moon. And I see here things are going to start working in your favor. All of those times you've sacrificed, everything that you've always given, as well as I'm seeing, uh, you know, you never being appreciated for some things you do, as well as uh, people taking you for granted because, oh, that that's my Aquarius. They'll just always help, you know, and because it's so often and so much uh, people don't really appreciate here. You're about to get such appreciation this month that's going to make you feel uh, very special. Okay, it's something that the universe is guiding here and uh, pushing people to come forward as well, especially with a certain someone, okay, kind of tugging at someone's heart to uh, get them to view you and see how much you've been through, okay, for other people. And you just keep quiet here in the hermit car. You don't, you don't ask for, you know, appreciation. You don't ask for attention. You just keep going because you do it selflessly right everything is uh, given out of unconditional love okay so you are the humanitarians of the deck and it looks like the universe is definitely taking notice this month okay things are going to kind of surprise you all right so let's see what's going on with your person's energy and I see when it comes to them you know, you still are just trying to, uh, you know, focus in this world and become the better version of yourself and uh, do what you need to do uh, to progress in life, right? You guys are the go-getters as well. So uh, I love this for you this month. Uh, the Emperor, the Fool, and the Six of Pentacles. Yeah, we have reciprocity here. So this shows me a lot that this person in the past, they have not taken control of this connection and have been there for you. You have given so much to this person, whether it be advice, uh, whether it just be this solid foundation for them and some helping out financially as well. Uh, and they've taken this for granted. They've not appreciated you in any sense. And now they're seeing that they need to come forward, take control, okay? Be the person they need to be for you. This is a change of mindset where they want to be able to take care of you. They want to be the person that you rely on. Something suddenly switched here, okay? They didn't see the value of this before or why they should, okay? They're a lot about taking uh, because they kind of got so attached to you here, Aquarius, that they felt like you were their rock. So, you know, they just, the more that you helped, the more they wanted. Okay. It was almost like, uh, I don't want to say an addiction here, but they got really attached fast. And it was like when they wanted to feel good, they would come to you. Right. Uh, tell me the full card. You were such a positive, uplifting, uh, thing in their life here. Fool. 
Yeah, Knight of Cups. Now they want to turn the tables around. But now they're figuring out how to do this, okay? Because I see that this has been stuck for a while. You might have not have been in communication as well for a while. Or if you have, it's been so sporadic. And it seems like there's nothing of substance, okay, when you've communicated here. And it seems to be all about them. So let's see what's gone on in the past here. Eight of Swords, Six of Pentacles, Seven of Cups. Okay, so I see for some of you, this person could work a lot. They are trapped uh, in a situation where they have lost a job or their finances have been so down that they every time they work and work and try to get it up, it just keeps going back down. Okay, so for some too, they owe a lot of money or um, have to work themselves up to the point where they have stability here. They're back on track. And so the focus on love, they don't have enough time to be with you or to focus on that. And they retract back and try not to contact you as much because they feel when they do, they get so drawn in that their focus is not on finances or stability anymore. It's just on you. So the less they talk to you, the better is what I'm seeing for them. Okay, that's just how their method of thinking is. For others of you, they are stuck in a situation here they can't get out of. They feel like they are in this endless battle of trying to figure out a way to come be with you uh, in the way that they want. But it seems like every time they do, something gets thrown their way. Okay, this, there's a panic here. And uh, they keep it hidden to themselves. They don't let you know this. Uh, how much you mean to them as well as uh, what they really do want uh, in the future here. Okay, tell me about this Eight of Swords. So this can be anything they're trapped in. An environment, a third party, something. They are just completely stuck. And the more they move, they feel like the reins get tighter. Okay, Page of Wands. Yeah, it's like they're, they are only allowed to just do a little bit in this uh, connection. And there's a sense of feeling bad when they only give a little bit because they take so much when they do come forward. So you end up getting nothing. And then this makes them feel bad about themselves. But this person's very silent. They keep everything to themselves. They don't like to communicate uh, anything hard emotionally or what they're truly feeling. It's something that they feel makes them look weak and they don't like that. Okay, tell with the Page of Wands. So it really makes them look like they have one foot in and one foot out here. Seven of Wands, yeah. They feel like they must put their guard up because if you knew the true story or how they were really feeling, you may not see them in the same way that you first got connected with them. You might just find that you need to move on and they don't want to lose you, okay? So let's see what's happening in the challenge. Let's get some more details. Hanged man, nine of cups, eight of wands. Yeah, because of the lack of action and the lack of uh, making you a priority here, you really judge this and go, is this too good to be true? What am I doing? Maybe I need to just release uh, any of this excess energy because even though they see you as their wish fulfillment and you do too in the beginning here as the nine of cups this is that feeling where it's very euphoric you both felt like you know there was this was a match made in heaven at times uh, but things as they progressed you started to learn that their words didn't meet their actions right in fact they just didn't do much at all but you could still feel that connection right? You just knew they felt for you on such a deep level, but they weren't willing to express it. And so this made you frustrated at times. It felt like things were always all over the place. This person was never going to step up and uh, be your better half here in this connection. Uh, tell me the eight of wands. And there's something they needed to release here, the hanged man. When in reality, their chains and bonds were put on uh, by themselves, okay? Because no matter how hard it gets, there's always an option. There's always something you can do. It may be tough. It may be hard, but it is a choice. And they just didn't see a way out. Eight of Wands Towers. Yes, yeah, something unexpected has happened here, especially in their environment that you are unaware of. Uh, and for those of you that do know this, 
it's a job loss or something that totally destroyed the opportunity for them to become closer to you here. And it's something so devastating to them that the, when this happened, they really pushed back even more. It's like all of a sudden you were getting breadcrumbs to nothing. It was like they wouldn't call for longer periods of time. And when they would call, it seemed like they were so preoccupied. They had other things on their mind or they just weren't focused on you. So you kind of felt like, why are you even calling me? Right? There's a sadness and emotional distress and a lot of anxiety that um, because of how they handled this, it affected you in a major way. It was like something where you just didn't want to worry all the time. You didn't want to have to think about it because you were focused on your life and trying to uh, you know, keep your stable as well. So they kind of rocked the stability okay, in your uh, current environment. So let's see what action they take this month. We have the sun, seven of swords and ace of wands. Things are coming to light. All of a sudden, this burden you've been carrying around or have felt so depleted is about to be lifted. This is a gift from the universe that is going to be so special and will touch your heart. Okay, so if this reading is resonating with you in the extended, we're going to go over exactly what action they take here, what they're going to say to you moving forward, as well as the timing and the outcome. If this is your last stop, thank you so much for joining me. I love you, my Aquarius, and I'll see you next time.